Hey there, how's it going? I see you're in here for another uh, test run. Er, wait, never mind. This isn't a test run. My bad. My bad. Actually, no, we are throwing down on some uh, metal slug. And uh, mission one. Throwing down here. And actually, this is a co op run, if you have not noticed. Playing with my little homie E. That's what we'll refer to him as. You can uh, clearly see he's a much superior player than I. And uh, what better time to throw down a co op game than. Take the opportunity, let's do this. Now let's see if I can pull up some background on this particular game itself. This was a fun game to co-op with. I thought so. And little shorty here, he was having some fun, he was having a blast. Although I think I created a little monster with that little dude. Cause now all he wants to do is play games, but it's much easier than worrying about him trying to poke his eye out with a screwdriver or some thing like that. It takes a little, you know, training and nudging along to get him going, but otherwise, uh, I don't know, he seems to pick it up for the most part, most of the time. Let's see, here we go. Get some backstory, storyline to this game while we're at it. How about it? Oh, we both get taken out. Alright, let's see. Developers is NASCA Corporation. Publishers is SNK. It was released in a large variety of platforms. Metal Slug is a run-and-gun video game for the Neo Geo console, arcade platform developed by NASCAR Corporation and published by SNK. It was originally released in 1996 for the MVS arcade platform. The game is widely known for its sense of humor, fluid hand-drawn animation, and fast-paced two-player action. It is the first title in the Metal Slug series. Gameplay. Player 1 is Marco and 2 is Tarma. Has to constantly shoot at continual stream of enemies in order to reach the end of a level. At the end of each level the player confronts a boss who is often considerably, considerably larger than regular enemies and takes many shots to defeat. On the way through the level the player finds weapon upgrades and Metal Slug tanks known as SV-001 Super Vehicle that can be used not only as weapons but also as added defense. Oh, looks like we're at the boss and this is coming to a conclusion very, very soon. I'm sure you rather would have seen it gone on longer, but hey, uh, there you go. It also appears I do have an out-of-sync issue between my recording and, um, the playback, but I guess I shouldn't be all too surprised. But it looks like we defeated our enemy boss guy, so for the time being, I do want to thank you for watching, like, and subscribe, tune in next time, this is the end of Mission 1, and I'll see you, goodbye.